was looking through YouTube for castle tutorials on Minecraft to see what was out there and I found things that were either too prescriptive and took away the creativity or just too general in terms of their tips and so I thought I'd come up with a way of building castles which was a bit more foolproof but kept the creativity and kept you guys you know, your imagination running right and also could cope with lots of different terrains. For example, in this little island here, I've got a nice big sort of canyon down here. I've got some rocks over here, but I've also got a bit of space to build a different set of towers. So this tutorial will show you how to build four towers in Minecraft. It'll show you how to build this tower and this tower and this tower and also this tower at the back. That one is the same as that one. And that one is the same as this one. And this one, as you can see, it can nestle nicely into the side of a building as well. And all the buildings can be easily joined up as well. It's kind of using a little three by three or five by five system, which lets you join things up. This tower can join onto this tower very easily. You can have little bridges going between them. It is really simple to make a castle looking good if you use this four tower building system, scatter your towers wherever you want and kind of join them up as long as they're all lined up. What you do want to do is get the center of this tower lined up with the center of this one and the center of this one uh, and after that you can have a little bit of creativity for example this tower isn't lined up with these two so we've got a little kind of a, a wonky s-shaped wall which is cool it uh, it joins them up nicely like that so they don't need to be completely on center but this one and this one again the middle of this tower joins onto the middle of this tower so that's the kind of the tower building system so let's choose this middle tower here this big one and get that built First, call this tower number one, if you will. These are the ingredients you need. You need some stone bricks, some dead brainy coral block, pickable with a normal pickaxe, believe me on that one, iron bars, polished andesurosite, we've got some cobblestone stairs, and some stone slabs. This is the pattern you need almost. What am I stick at the maker? There is the pattern you need for this tower. Okay, so let me take you through that. So it's uh, one, two, three, four, five in stone bricks, or whatever you want, actually. One, two, one, two, like that. Gonna make a little corner like that. Then it's one, two, three, four, five, and one, two. You see how these, this two and this two are in the same direction as these five? That's kind of the key to this tower. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, one, two. See, in the same direction on each side. And then this side, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, two, two. Two, two. So it's I5, 225, Okay, what I want to do is extend this up 13 blocks in total. So it's 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12, 13. And you've got to do that all the way around. But what you can do is actually mix in some dead brainy coral kind of at the same time. So as you're building this, mark in some dead brainy coral on uh, the sides and the middles, and it just builds in really, really nicely like that. You can kind of scatter the dead brainy coral wherever you want, and it just actually looks really, really good. So let me just show you how this corner might look like that. See what I mean? Doesn't it look great? It looks as if different blocks have been made, and that's what real castles are like. If you look at a real castle, it's not perfect. Um, it has all sorts of different blocks like that, just big stones, little stones, and medium stones. They built castles with, with whatever they could get their hands on, so that's what you want to do. Anyway, so you want to extend these walls uh, 13 high in total. You want to mix in some dead brainy coral or other corals, if you can get them as well. It might look quite good. I just, I'm just in love with the dead brainy coral. Mix it in, scatter about, make it random, make it 13 high, and I will rejoin you in a second. Just before we do that, let me tell you about this system where you can get your name and a message read out during one of my videos. So big shout out and thank you to Tommy14, Dowdrick and Ryan113, who are my top donors on Recharge, that's Recharge with three A's, recharge.com forward slash Andy is Yoda. You can put a message in there for me and I'll read out your name and the message in my next video, recharge.com forward slash Andy is Yoda. This is how it works. You go into that website, recharge.com, forward slash Andy's Yoda and you'd install an app on your phone or your tablet. They give you a choice of apps, it's a game or an app. You use that app for a couple of minutes and in return for you trying out their app, they'll send me a dollar, two dollars, even up to five or eight dollars for free. It doesn't cost you anything, doesn't cost me anything, but I get a, a free donation and you get your name written out and a message and you're helping to support my channel.
So a big shout out and thank you to Neviliptic, uh, Glenn, Gizmo and John. You can also do it uh, anonymously as well. And more shout outs to Jonathan, Owen, George, Tommy, Karmar and Matty and Dowdrick again. Thank you guys for helping me. Okay, I've done that all the way around. You can see it's looking pretty random and actually pretty cool. Okay, you can even do a better job than me, I am sure. Uh, onto this, I'm going to slap on a ring of polished Andy's Yoda sight all the way around. Just like that, nice and quick. And then on top of that, I'm going to put some more, well, anything you like, actually. It's going to be covered up. By the way, it doesn't need to be 13 blocks plus 14 plus 15 high. It could be as tall as you want. You can match it to your own castle needs. And this is what this castle building system is all about. Matching it to your needs, your castle, your design, your terrain. You make it exactly the way you want it. It might turn out like mine. It might not. Okay, uh, around this, we're going to put some upside down cobblestone stairs. Make sure they join on nicely like that this is uh, probably the biggest tower on the castle so you want to maybe position this exactly uh, in the right place first and put all the smaller towers around it there we go perfect uh, next, we're going to go for stone bricks, and these are going to go all the way around on top of the cobblestone stairs that you just placed. Pretty simple task to do. All the different levels and layers in here, all, where the floors go, that is up to you because you'll have different towers connecting at different levels, different walkways, gangplanks, and all sorts of things connecting in different places. And what you want to do is make sure your levels um, all come in. At, you know, I've got levels there, 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 all, all sorts of different levels. And that's the great thing about this system. It lets you have a lot of creativity and you start to build all your little nooks and crannies, which I love. I love my nooks and crannies when building a castle. Right, on top of this, we want to go one, two, three, four, like that. And that starts to form the little crenellations at the side. Now in this system we're going to have to go here and here and then one, two, three, four, here and here, one, two, three, four, here and here, one, two, three, four, here and here. Okay and then I've just added a little bit of detail onto this. I've put these um, everywhere I can, just spamming these little stone slabs there, 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 there. I didn't go for that one there for some reason. I went here, 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 boom. Extra little details. We like the details in Minecraft. There we go. Um, of course, you're going to need some sort of floor for this as well. And I would say this is an excellent um, level to do your floor. You could make it out of stone bricks like this. Don't forget to include your staircase and maybe, or maybe a ladder linking to different levels as well. Um, you could obviously use maybe oak slabs or even oak planks would make a good floor as well. There we go. Let me just finish this off. Doesn't take long. That's, so that's one tower done. And all you've got to do, all we've got to do in this tutorial is get through another three towers and you should be well on your way to a nice castle-y building system. Some of the detail I like to put in this tower are some windows that kind of just come down on different levels like that. I think that looks quite smart. And don't forget if you're having another tower, you kind of line it up with the middle there. And then you can have doors, <laughs> you can have doors in and out wherever, wherever you want. Again, little windows like that. I think that looks quite smart when they're just different, have different heights like that. It really does make a difference. Let's move this one down actually. It looks a lot better when it's there, something like that. Actually looks pretty smart. There we go. So that's our first tower done. Let's move on to tower number two. Right, I choose this tower here, skinny little tower here as tower number two. As you can see, we've got bricks, we've got stone bricks, we've got dead brainy coral, and we've got more iron bars, and that is it. We've actually got full uh, block bricks as well. If you don't want to use bricks, another great thing we'll be to use is prismarine bricks and brick slabs. Prismarine would make a nice blue roof on that. Okay, let's get this one done. So tower number two, I'm gonna actually line it exactly up with this tower. I'm going to go one, two, three. So the middle one here is exactly opposite the middle one right there. So it's one, two, three. It's a three, one, 
three tower, three one three tower. So the complicated bit, obviously, with this tower is the roof. So we'll go through this nice and slowly. So there, yeah, there we go. So what I want to do is build that up, just however many levels you want. I think I'm going to add maybe twelve or thirteen levels onto it. Of course, what you want to do now is kind of make it built of the same materials. So you need to add in some of your dead brainy coral or whatever block you want to kind of mix things up. Let me just make a kind of a token effort here for the tutorial. Make this all like this. There we go. And of course, your windows, your windows can go in whatever level you want. That just kind of depends on your walkways, your adjoining. Uh, yeah, you're adjoining walkways. Right, so what we want to do now is grab your brick slabs and we'll go for this little fancy roof. I think you'll like this roof. If you can kind of memorize this roof and learn it, then you can always, you're always able to produce this tower wherever you want to. Fill in the corners, first of all, with little brick slabs or whatever slabs you choose. Wooden roofs would look fine as well. Then we go one, two, three. Oh, one, two, three. One, two, three on the sides. One, two, three. Pretty straightforward so far. We'll just hold the camera above there for a few seconds and you can see exactly what I have done. I've forgotten one block. We need um, some, let me search for it. We need some brick stairs as well. We need some brick stairs as well. So the brick stairs are going to be next, actually. They're going to go here, 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 and here. There we go. Pretty straightforward so far. And then we're going to go for more of these uh, little brick slabs. And the brick slabs are going to go there and there beside the stairs and that leaves the little corners to do so do the corners one two three four and that's where we've got to so far pretty straightforward I hope you agree right what we want to do now is add in some bricks all the way around here one two three one two three like that little layer of bricks and oops we're also going to uh, grab some more stairs we're going to go one two, three, four on the stairs. And then we're going to grab some more. Um, oh, before we do that, we're going to grab some brick slabs and put them beside the stairs. So brick slabs beside the stairs or sl whatever slabs you're using. Beside the there we go. There we go. So it should look like that so far. Good, 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 good. Now it's back to bricks again. One, two, three, four. Just a little three by three space like that. Okay, I think it looks fine. And then we're going to add on another layer there, like that. So that should be, you should see it's kind of uh, a one one brick high space above that. Um, I'm going to go for more stairs. One, two, three, four. And then solid brick there. And I'm going to add on two more. One, two more. Uh, I'll show you how to do my uh, flag design, and then we won't have to do the flag design on any of the other towers. Just put flags on whichever towers you want. So we're going to go one, two, three, four in whatever fence you like. One block there, a couple of blocks there, and then we want one block there. And I think it looks kind of a funky little flag design. So that's two towers. Come on. Half your castle's built. If you can, you can scatter these towers and use them again and again and again. If you're building a really big castle, you'd actually build, um, you'd have quite a few of these towers. You see, you could even fit a tower like that on the side of that tower. It'd look kind of epic. Right, let's choose the third tower. Okay, let's choose this fatter cousin over here from this tower. As you can see, I haven't even bothered putting in kind of windows, but you can put windows in wherever you want. Just add the detail. Right, so a bit of a fatter cousin than that one here, a bit of a, a bigger tower, kind of a formal. Um, so you can see it's a 515 tower, so we need some bricks, dead brainy coral, iron bars, we've got some stone brick stairs, we've got oak fence, and then simply slabs and solid blocks of brick and also brick stairs again. So yeah, let's get this tower built. This tower is a 515 tower. I'm actually gonna line this tower up with this one right here. So um, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, the middle block here should spam or be right opposite. I don't know why I said the word spam. Right opposite the middle one there. So it's a five, one, five, one, one, two, three, four, five, one, 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 two, three, four. Oh, did I make a mistake? <laughs> That's cool. I made a little mistake. I can't even count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Duh. One, one, two, three, four, five. One, 
one, two, three, four, five, one. You get that sinking feeling as you go wrong. This is not working out. <laughs> okay, that tower can be as tall as you want. I think I'm gonna add like 12 blocks onto it. Add in some uh, more dead brainy coral, be right back. Nice easy building system right there. Okay, uh, let's go for these upside down stairs. We're gonna make some little windows right at the very, very top. So gap, gap, stair, stair, like that. Boom, boom. So we need to do that on all four sides. Really, we're cutting in, I guess, like that, aren't we? We're going one, two, three, one, two, three, boom, 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 boom. One, two, three, one, two, three, boom, 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 like that. And then, yeah, these little... These look great in a castle when you use this little uh, fence post like that. Doesn't that look cool? Of course, lots of different fence posts to use. You could even put, um, you could even, if you went really crazy, you could get some of these uh, spruce trap doors and you could um, scatter these about as well. It would look kind of cool like that or like that as well. Not bad, huh? Not bad. Right, time for the roof. So it's another one of these uh, brick slabby roof efforts. I've dropped my slab, there we go. So, um, again, what we want to do is have upper slabs here, just fill in these four corners like that. Nice, simple start. Very similar roof to that one over there, just slightly bigger, obviously, to start with. And once you've done that, we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, oops, on the sides. Cool. Goody, 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 goody. Right. And what we want to do is put brick stairs right in the middle like that. This is very similar to the last time. But beside it, we're gonna go turned in, turned in. Turn, 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 turn. It makes that little shape there, isn't that cool? One, two, oops, done that one already, silly billy. Um, then we're just gonna uh, put slabs everywhere else. So slab, 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 there we go. Um, right, what we want to do is add brick on the inside. So we're going to go in the corners first of all with the brick. And then one, two, three, 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 one, two, three like that. There we go. Ne bad, ne bad, ne bad, ne bad, ne bad. Right, um, bricks right in the middle again. One, two, three, four like that, and then it simply slabs on all these other two, 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 two bits. Two, 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 there we go. We're getting there, not far to go, not far to go now. Um, more bricks on the inside at this level, all the way around. Brick blocks, like that. And then on top of that, just a full, another full level of bricks all the way around. On top of them, more stairs. <laughs> One, two, three, four. And then we're gonna go just, you know, really be bricking yourself at this point. There we go, brick, 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 brick. And then another level up here. And that's pretty much it. We're gonna go uh, stair, stair, <laughs> stair, and then finally at the top, just stick out, out another couple of bricks. Sorry it was fast, but you can go back, rewind it, pause it, and so on. Three towers done. How could you fail to build a castle? Now you know three towers. Um, and they look kind of ordinary, you know? Lots of detail you can add to these. Bushes, vines, walkways, parapets, balconies. Bring your castle to life. I'm not gonna do it all for you. I don't wanna take away the creativity. That's why this is kind of the construction, the building blocks of a castle. So onto the last tower here. And as you can see, it's probably the most complicated tower. It's this one here. It's got this kind of really, really fancy lookout kind of gallery at the top. And these things are awesome. They just open up like that and you can have a look out and see who is coming along the street. Not bad, huh? So let's clear the inventory and pick out the blocks that we want for this particular tower. So we've got stone bricks. I haven't put much brainy coral in. Hmm. Oh well. Um, we've got oak fence in here. We've got oak planks. Obviously you're gonna need plenty of spruce trap doors. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. Is that right? 13? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Thirteen for each side you're gonna need. And you're gonna need quite a few oak fences, and you're gonna need 
quite a few brick slabs. Okay, so let's get, uh, yeah, let's get this effort built. Here we go. Um, I've already done this tower. It's the same tower as that one over there. It's a three, one, three, one, three, one tower. So once you've got that done, what you want to do is grab, by the way, I've picked up some oak stairs as well. So we're going to put some oak planks around here. There we go. Oops. And then just fill this in as well. This is going to be where you stand on top of the tower. Don't forget you're going to need to add in some staircases or ladders to get up there as well. But that's up to you. That is up to you. I'm um, going to add on some upside down oak stairs on the sides like that. There we go. And then in the corners, oak plank, oak plank, oak plank, oak plank, oak, oak, no joke. There we go. Cool, huh? Um, then we're going to go for some, uh, our first of our many oak fences in the corners and on the middles. Corner, corner, middle, corner, corner, middle, corner, corner, done. Done, I tell you, done. Um, right, now we want to go a bit crazy with our Trapidorus Maximus, our spruce trapdoors. So um, what I'm going to do is one, two, three, one, two, three, like that. So they get stacked up like that. Um, these ones on the sides get stacked up twice like that. Same over here. There we go. Um, the ones inside here, I did like this. And then these ones on the outside, I went one, two, three. So you can see these open out so you can really, when you're in here, you can kind of see out and, and see who's coming from your little tour. So that needs to be done the same exact on all four sides. Be right back when that is complete. Done it, I done it, I done it, I done it. Um, fence, 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 oops. Fence like that. So they come up by three. In fact, we'll go in here and do it. So it's one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. So we need this corner one as well. Same on all three sides, <laughs> four sides. Same on all four sides. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. That's what happens, you start counting to threes too much. You start thinking that squares have got three sides. <sighs> Bizarre, right. Um, let's bring these across nicely like that. Pretty straightforward. It's one, two, three, four, five. All joins on. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. Cool. Right, now it's time for our roof. So let's grab your choice of slab. Gonna go, oops, starting nice and easy. One, two, three on the sides. One, two, three. One, oops, don't go there. One, two, three, and one, two, three, like that. Good. Um, that should afford you two little diagonals like that. One, two, if everything has gone to plan, you should have these little diagonals there and there, there. There, good, 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 good. I like this. I like this so far. Whew. Right. Um. What do we want? We want some of the blocks which I haven't got in my inventory. For some reason bricks. We want solid bricks. We want solid bricks all the way around. So one, two, three. 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 And also corner, 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 corner. It should look like that so far. Then we can reach for stairs again. I haven't got stairs. Sorry, brick stairs. And the brick stairs are going to go again in the middles. Four of them. Pretty straightforward. I hope you agree. Right, the next thing we want to do is go for uh, bricks. We're going to go brick, 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 brick behind the stairs. And that lets you put in little diagonals, hopefully. Like this. That. Obviously, these ones are actually not necessary, but I'm just going to leave them in. Um, so there we go. That's what it should look like so far. So how many levels have we done? I can kind of see from the sides if I hold the camera here, I suppose. Next, we need more stairs. I mean, stair, 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 stair. Root to stair, you know. It is root to stair. Anyway, we're doing it. In the corners, let's go brick, 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 brick. And really good progress is being made. Absolutely easy peasy so far. Let's just fill in these blocks behind the stairs. Uh, next we're going to go one, two, three, four with bricks there and then slabs in the corners. One, two, three, 
four, and then more stairs on top. One, two, three, four. Quite a quick stage, that, actually. And then one, two on top. And there we go. Fourth tower complete. And that's the system done. Hopefully these four towers should let you build a castle on whatever terrain you've got, whatever countryside biome, whatever you've got, you can add these four towers and you can have them at different heights as well, it doesn't matter. I've got a cute little connecting walkway as well here, which I absolutely love, just made out of some simple uh, slabs and trap doors. And as you can see, I'll hold the camera there, take a screenshot if you want. Um, I've got little walkways going between these castles as well. Really, really simple, just with some little slabs. If I take these ones away, you can see exactly how I did that. Couldn't be simpler. Little walkway here, which is kind of cool. I love the little nooks and crannies you get out of this. It's just awesome. You can walk up here. You can walk along here. <laughs> it's just great through here boom 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 we've got a, i was forming a little staircase in there yet to do it and then you're into this bit here and then you're walking across a bridge it is fun it is fun finally to build castles in minecraft and it's easy when you've got these four towers thank you for watching everyone don't forget to hit that like button i'll see you next time ciao ciao with the blocks be with you